Hey guys, in this video, I'll break down the five best DJ controllers. I've made this list based on mixing performance, additional features, build quality, and more. I've included options for every type of consumer. So whether you're looking for something easy to use for beginners or a professional grade option with almost any feature you could need, I'll have the perfect DJ controller for you. If you want more information and the most up-to-date pricing on the products you mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description. Okay, so let's get started with the video. If you're looking for a versatile controller that's compatible with multiple platforms and two different software programs for in-depth mixing, the Reloop Mixon 4 is my choice as the best DJ controller for most people. The Reloop Mixon 4 is a hybrid controller that can pair with two different software programs for increased mixing control, and it comes with near-universal compatibility, several useful inputs and outputs, and multiple effect modes to enhance your live performance. It comes with a reasonably compact, lightweight build that only weighs around 11 pounds, so you shouldn't have any issues moving it around. It has a sturdy, stylish build with vibrant RGB lighting on the pads, and it features several connectivity options, including a mic input, a USB port, two master outputs, booth outputs, and two separate headphone ports. It offers multi-platform support and can easily be connected to Macs, PCs, Android tablets, or iPads for greater versatility. I also like that the volume wheel can be pressed to sit flush with the board, which helps prevent damage during transportation. In contrast to cheaper options like the Roland DJ505, it's designed to deliver plug-and-play functionality with the Serato DJ Pro and Algorithm DJ Pro software for increased mixing control, though it doesn't come with either program. It offers Spotify integration to keep your favorite tracks accessible, useful suggestions for tracks that mix well with the song being played based on the key and BPM, and a harmonic mixing mode to quickly sync the keys of multiple songs. The pads also allow you to trigger sounds or cues, play sample slices, or utilize macro FX features to create dramatic breaks or transitions. While it doesn't quite offer the same class-leading control as the Pioneer DDJRZ, the Reloop Mixon 4 is a solid all-around controller that performs well in most situations, which makes it an ideal option for anyone who doesn't need professional-grade features. If you're looking for a high-performance board with several advanced features at a lower price than most premium models, this might be the best choice for you. Next up, we have a solid all-around DJ controller that offers an intuitive setup process and similar features to more expensive options. The Roland DJ505 is a great option for the money to consider. Roland's DJ505 controller is an easy-to-use, compact alternative to premium models that offers an excellent price-to-performance ratio, a built-in drum machine, and a solid amount of production tools for a reasonable price. While it lacks the high-end build quality of more expensive models, it offers solid build quality for the price, and the rotaries and faders should be able to withstand long-term usage. It comes with balanced XLR outputs that can connect to professional PA systems, booth outs, separate quarter-inch and eighth-inch headphone jacks, and a quarter-inch microphone input to add vocals or external instruments to your mix. Unfortunately, it lacks full-size jog wheels like the Pioneer DDJ1000, but they feel relatively sturdy and provide responsive low-latency inputs when scratching, mixing, or searching for songs. It also provides vibrant RGB lighting for darker settings, though some users might find the design somewhat loud. It comes with a built-in programmable TRS drum machine that delivers a range of high-quality, realistic full-kit drum sounds and in-depth controls for the level, attack, decay, and tone to fine-tune your rhythm section. You also get licenses for the Serato DJ Pro software and Serato Toolkit, which provides a solid amount of additional effects and sampler modes for increased control over your mix. Even more, it features a classic 16-step sequencer to create drum patterns or samples, several performance pads to quickly activate your desired effects, a 3-band EQ to customize your sound, and high- and low-pass filter knobs for smoother transitions between songs. The Roland DJ505 doesn't come with as many in-depth controls as the Reloop Mixon 4, but it offers similar functionality and features for a much lower price, which makes it a great value choice. 
This is an ideal option if you don't want to spend too much money, but want a controller that provides more advanced mixing capabilities than most other controllers in this range. Some users might be looking for an inexpensive, easy-to-use option that can nail the basics and help you hone your DJing skills. The Pioneer DDJ SB3 is my choice as the best DJ controller for beginners, and Pioneer has several high-quality offerings to choose from, and their affordable DDJ SB3 model comes with an intuitive layout that's ideal for entry-level users, plug-and-play functionality, and a solid amount of FX and scratch modes. It has a smaller, lighter build than the higher-end Pioneer DDJ models on this list, and it features built-in, easy-grab handles for better portability. You get a solid range of connectivity options for the price, including an 8-inch headphone output, an RCA output, and a solid quarter-inch mic input circuit to ensure everything you play remains crystal clear at higher volumes. It also features an intuitive layout with all the essential features for mastering the basics, and it includes durable, low-latency 5-inch jog wheels for seamless mixing and solid scratch response and accuracy. It's also easy to set up and can connect to your computer via a USB port. While the included Serato DJ Lite software is somewhat limited, it's easy to use, provides several essential functions, and you can upgrade to the Pro version for an additional fee if you require more features. I also like that it has a built-in sophisticated scratch pad feature, which allows you to add scratch effects to songs without needing a turntable. And it comes with eight different settings that can automatically match the song's BPM without breaking rhythm. You also get an intuitive beginner-friendly FX fade function with eight different settings for smoother transitions between tracks. The Pioneer DDJ SB3 is more limited compared to premium options like the DDJ1000, but it provides all the essential features for mixing and can reliably nail the basics, which makes it ideal for anyone new to DJing. If you're a beginner who wants an inexpensive, functional model that can help you learn the ropes and deliver solid, all-around performance, this might be your best bet. For anyone who wants a high-end DJ controller that offers an excellent blend of connectivity options, durability, and sophisticated mixing effects, the Pioneer DDJ1000 is my choice as the best overall option and with its unique HD screens to view important information at a glance, sophisticated companion software, comprehensive range of effects, and excellent build quality, the Pioneer DDJ1000 is a great option for enthusiasts or serious DJs. It has a much heftier footprint than the previously mentioned DDJ SB3, but it offers more in-depth controls and still only weighs around 13 pounds, so it's not too difficult to transport between events. It comes with robust, full-size jog wheels that are optimized to provide top-tier scratch response and accuracy, and you can use the jog feeling adjust mechanism to easily set your desired resistance. Each wheel also features unique HD LCD screens that allow you to quickly view important information such as BPM, waveform, playback position, and hot cue or loop points. It comes with four inputs, which gives you the flexibility to connect CDJs, analog turntables to use the controller as a standalone mixer, and professional PA equipment. You get 16 backlit rubberized performance pads that allow you to quickly activate multiple mixing functions including hot cues, several pad effects, beat jumps, key shifts, sampler or keyboard modes, and more. It's also compatible with the Rekordbox DJ Companion software for in-depth mixing control, and like the Reloop Mixon 4, it offers a useful, related tracks feature that suggests compatible songs with what you're playing. The low latency Magvel fader is another standout feature that's rated to last for around 10 million movements, so it should be able to withstand heavy duty usage over time. The Pioneer DDJ1000 is the best overall DJ controller because of its robust build quality, in-depth controls, range of effects, and superior performance to the less expensive models on this list. I would recommend this for serious or professional DJs who require a comprehensive, in-depth board that provides several advanced features and top-tier mixing capabilities. If you're looking for a DJ controller that offers class-leading performance, mixing versatility, and several additional advanced features, the Pioneer DDJ-RZ is my choice as the best high-end option available 
The Pioneer DDJRZ is more expensive than the other options on this list, but you pay for performance and it comes with an intuitive layout, a heavy duty build, a built in oscillator sampler, and next generation control for professional DJs. As Pioneer's flagship model, it's designed to be a fully featured controller that combines two CDJ style track controllers, a four channel mixer with solid standalone versatility, and 16 performance pads for your preferred effects. You get a sturdy, well-made board, aluminum jog wheels, and robust rotaries and controls to withstand heavy-duty club usage over time, and it's relatively lightweight for better portability. It also comes with a broad range of venue-friendly connections, including six analog inputs, XLR and RCA master outs, two mic inputs, a booth out, two headphones outputs, and two USB ports on the mixer for your laptop. I think the jog wheels are a standout feature, and they come with the same jog adjust controls as the Pioneer DDJ-1000, so you can alter the sensitivity for a range of mixing requirements. You also get a license for the Rekordbox DJ software, which offers plug-and-play compatibility with the controller, related tracks functionality, in-depth mixing and transport controls, and a built-in sequencer for preparing your own music, though the workflow is very reliant on your laptop's screen. Additionally, it features a standard tempo fader, a button for programming the master tempo, a three-band EQ, OSC sample triggers with four sounds, and a sound color FX strip with reverb, phase, pitch, and filter effects. The Pioneer DDJRC is the best high-end DJ controller because of its outstanding range of inputs, feature-rich mixing software, heavy-duty build quality, and several useful advanced features to justify the price tag. If you can afford the high price or if you're a professional DJ who needs a controller that offers professional-grade features and mixing performance, this might be the best option for you.